it's John here and welcome to another how to build in Minecraft. Hey sheep. Bye sheep. Look at all these animals. This is freaking crazy. Anyway, so today we're going to be building something super freaking fun because when we used to live in California, uh, one of our houses, I don't, I don't need egg. <laughs> when we lived in California, one of our houses didn't have a pool and it's really, really hot in California. For those of you that live in California, you know exactly what I freaking mean. So what we used to do for the kids' birthday parties is we used to rent these uh, giant inflatable slides, water slides, uh, in the backyard, bouncy houses slash water slides. And that's what we're going to build right here. We're going to build a bouncy house with a crazy freaking water slide uh, to play because we're going we're gonna to have a good time. We're going to have a good time. So what we're going to do here is because they have all these great colors in concrete now, we're going to use the concrete blocks, not because they're soft or anything, but because they're super, super freaking bright. So we're going to be building this cool little structure. We're going to build a little staircase going up, plus uh, the little bouncy house. So we're going to be needing to do a, a frame first of the shape of it, and then the actual uh, the slide and whatnot itself. Let's go ahead and get started. So I'm going to use green for my outline. I'm going to go one, two, three, four, and that's going to be just enough area for the staircase. And then one, two, three, four, five, oh, in the wrong spot, five, six, and seven and that's gonna be just enough room for uh the pool area and the it's like a little splash pad and the bottom of the slide so now we're gonna go back now this the pool area or the splash pad area is gonna be one two three and four and then the the um slide itself starts here and it's gonna go up one two three four five and six blocks tall so we're gonna go six blocks out and then we'll do the actual uh, house itself so we are doing a total of, what is that? So it looks like we have an 11 by 11 space. So let's go ahead and close that in. Hey, hey pig. Hey, pig. All right, so we're going to bring this all the way through like so. Boom, boom, and boom. And then inside here, the splash pad area, I want to make it blue because I want to make the water look really, really beautiful. One, two, three, and four is the water area. So I'm going to remove this area here. We're going to go four blocks back and remove just four blocks in like so I'm gonna fill this all in with blue all right so that's good for for that part so now we need to do the actual uh, steps and then the slide itself so I'm gonna start off the steps to walk up right here and then the slide is gonna start off uh, one step further back it's gonna go like that that's going to be the slide, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. I think that's going to be too wide, but we can make it like a racing slide. It should be all right. So now uh, now I need to place down blocks. Now you can do, uh, you can simply just like place down these and uh, put more on top of it like that if you really want to. Uh, you're not going to see the bottom half of it, so it doesn't really matter what you do to put the steps on. So I'm going to do one, two, three. Ah. This is going to be uh, four. That's five. And this will be six. There it is. Then we're going to break the one on the inside because uh, that's going to be covered up by a, a railing kind of. You'll see what I mean in just a second. Okay, so that is our slide and stairs right there. And then we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and remove the center section like so. And we're gonna replace that with uh, with green because we have green on the outside. We'll do green right here as well. We'll do green there, 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 and there, just like that. And then on the outside here, we're, we're gonna do the same exact thing like so so we kind of have our outline here you can kind of remove some of these bottom blocks you're not going to see them again so it doesn't really matter whether you remove them or not it's really entirely up to you so you can kind of see it taking shape at this point right so we have stairs here you walk up to the top and the very top here is going to be our our bouncy house uh the bouncy house it's oh, fl why can't i fly sometimes i swear there's i can double tap the freaking a button <laughs> on the xbox uh, a million times sometimes and it just does absolutely freaking nothing anyway so 
let's go ahead and now we're going to build the bouncy house i'm going to use a slightly different color we're going to use the orange up here and we're going to use this to frame in the, the bouncy house itself so i'm going to bring it out the entire length of the of the entire jumper let's say right and then we're going to frame this in we're going to bring this back a little ways we're going to go one two three four and five so we're going to have a five open area in the middle there we're going to bring it out one more so we'll do a total of six and we're going to make this wrap around right okay there we go so that's our basic shape for our jumper now now we want to make make it have legs because it's going to look really awkward without them so we're going to go back to the green and actually bring this on up like so <coughs> And we're going to do the same thing here and we're going to fill all this in as well because it doesn't look good with just uh just the open space it doesn't quite look or feel like a jumper at this point so we're going to bring this in like that <coughs> i think we got to bring the bouncy house out one more block here you know what it is yeah we do okay so this has got to come out one more block sorry guys my mistake my mistake so we're going to remove this one and make this come out one more block. There we go. Okay, so now go back to the green. And I keep doing that. And we're going to bring this down to there. Perfect. Like so. And we'll go ahead and frame this in on the bottom here. And frame it in over here. And frame it in over here. Now we're going to fill in this center part with white you can use white concrete you can use quartz you can use really whatever you want i'm just going to use the white concrete here i'm going to go ahead and fill in uh this area here all right that's the side of our jumper there and then we're going to do the same thing in the back and you may want to, if you're playing in a uh, survival or not in peaceful you may want to light it up inside of there i'm, I'm in peaceful so it doesn't really matter uh, but you may want to light up that area right there and right here on the edges of these steps uh, once again, oh gee, it needs to be filled in there like that. And then we're going to be actually f doing the same thing that we did over here. We're going to be making these go up like so. and like so just like that so it needs to be up one step higher than the stairs all the way through otherwise the water is going to flow out so now we can fill this area in uh, before we even get started in the jumper area fill this in with water across the top and water will flow down the slide area now mind you it's going to flow over the uh the stairs because stairs act funny when it comes to water but it it, it does make you slide down smoother so and then this very bottom section here, you can kind of fill this in so it doesn't have any backflow. Ah. There we go. So that pool area is nice and filled in. And you can see the water is not going to spill out. It's just a water slide at this point. It's perfect. If you want to make this come out one more block, just to make it look a little less funny, I guess, uh, you could absolutely do that. Uh, I think I'm going to do that, actually, because it does look a little bit awkward, and I don't want it to... Yeah, that's that's far better. Okay, so I'm going to do the same thing on this side, then, just to match it up. There we go. And that is our steps and our slide area. Now, the center piece here, we're going to fill in with slime block. All the way through. Now, if you want, like I said... I would probably light up the area underneath. I think I'm going to actually. I think it'll look a lot nicer when we're all done. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to light it up with uh, some sea lanterns. Right underneath the, uh, the slime block. So you can't even see through it. So that way the slime block is covered up by these sea lanterns and you can't see underneath at all. So now you don't even have to worry about lighting it up. You can use whatever you like to cover it with. I'm just going to use the sea lanterns for two purposes. One, it's going to light up. I think it'll give it a really cool effect when it's all finished like this. 
and then we can bounce on a lit up pad which is really freaking cool and you'll never see a bounce house like this <laughs> that's for for darn sure okay so now let's go ahead and we're gonna do the uh the rest of the house and we're gonna make these go up uh three blocks one two and three blocks with the blue one two and three blocks and one two and three blocks like this and then even the doorway here, we're going to go one, two, and uh, three blocks, just like that. Now, the inside walls here, uh, we don't have net in Minecraft, so we're going to be using iron bars. We're just going to make believe that these are the netting. Because you'll notice that in bounce houses, there's always the netting that goes around the outsides of the, uh, of the bounce house, so you can't fall out. And uh, this would be a perfect alternative to netting, because I think it looks pretty close to what it is in, in real life. Um, if it was black, I think it would be perfect, but I, this is all we have to deal with. So we're going to go ahead and pretend we'll make believe that this is netting. Oops, wrong spot. There we go. Now we're going to cap the whole thing off with some yellow like this. Now we're not going to put netting in the very, very front because that's where you're going to jump out and go for your swim or slide, should I say. And we're going to actually cap this off at the top right here like this. And then we're going to go back over the rest of it with a little bit of orange. And we're going to bring the orange out one block and then one block. And then we'll keep doing that like so. And then I'm going to cap it off like this and cap it off again like this. And I may fill in that filled in uh, that capped off area with a different color just to be extremely colorful. Like this area here. I may do something like this. Yeah, I think that looks a lot better. So what we're going to do is we'll go to the very edge there, almost to the last block, the one block before. And then we're going to go back one block again. And then we're going to go back one block again like so and then one block again, and then the very top block. So that way we have uh, kind of a, an outline of, of where we are uh, laying out these blue blocks without having to worry about it after the fact. So we'll do it right to there, and we'll go right to here. And then again, we're skipping a one block on the inside and outside of each one, and that kind of gives us a platform to start our orange as well, and we can kind of do that. Check it out. If you want to bring these out a little ways to add a little bit of shade, I think that's a good idea, especially on the front side. On the back, I don't think you have to worry about it. Uh, but on the front, I think it might look nice. Like that. Yeah, that does look good. And then we can do one more right here. And then we can finish up the other side. And that is basically our bounce house. Uh, the only thing we need left is we need to bring out a pump system because you can't have a bounce house without something blowing it up. So usually they're coming off the side or the back. So I'm gonna have this one come out the back a little bit like this. And then we need uh, some type of pump system. So we will probably use, let's use a, a dispenser. That sounds like a good pump system. We're going to put a lever on it, turn it on and off. There we go. So you got your motor, your pump in the back here to blow all the, the, the air into the giant blow up. And now we have our, our, our blow up thing. So we can go ahead and hop in the water. We can go up here and we can bounce and bounce around and have a good time. And we can go down the water slide. Let's, let's go down the water slide. We, we, right, let's go back up here. Anyways, dudes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I did. It's a lot of fun to be in a bounce house. Don't forget to smash that like button. Oops, I think I broke something. Don't forget to smash that like button as hard as you can. And if you're at all new to this channel, if you guys can click that subscribe button, it helps the channel out a great deal. And while you're at it, if you click the little bell, it turns on notifications and lets you dudes and dudettes know when we upload our daily videos. And until next time, guys, see ya!